Today we have with us the most prominent dance group, the ones who made everyone talk on Kala Chashma, straight from Norway, the Quick Sands. Welcome to India, guys. Thank you so much. And Thank and you. let me tell my audience, today is a very special day for us as one of the members. It's his birthday today. Please, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god it's so i'm so excited it's like a fangirl moment for me today to see every one of you here tell me it's very difficult for me to control my energy levels how do you guys control your energy levels since you have been traveling around so much you're meeting most prominent people all around how is it like do you pinch each other that oh my god is this here or yeah you got it or now you're like yeah, just yeah. used to it that oh it's it's fine it's fine no even though like you say we we experience different things it's always a new thing you know so we have like you say we have to pinch each other and remind each other about guys we are on top of a bus in mumbai you know like we have to say these words for us to realize you know where we are and what we're doing so yeah we're not getting used to it <laughs> Speaking of Mumbai, uh, it's your second time here in Mumbai. Yes. How are you feeling? It describe Mumbai because I've seen you guys traveling uh, in the locals, no, uh, making videos with the dabba walas, and yes. you've been traveling all around in bus, look, uh, using the local transport. Tell, describe Mumbai in your own words. You know, we've talked about Mumbai uh, with a few people, and the thing that goes over and over is the fact that there's so much life. Everywhere you look, there's always someone in a rush to something. and it makes you want to do something it makes you feel inspired to work to do something and uh, that makes us gives us a lot of energy and that's why our energy is the way it is right now when we speak about mumbai we definitely talk about bollywood right yes. and uh, that's uh, how you guys went viral initially uh, 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 dancing on uh, bollywood songs tell me uh, do you remember any of the classic or uh, veteran actors from the 60s 70s 80s who were famous Yes. Yeah, any Bollywood actors or from that time if you remember? Eh, Dil ki chain. No his name? No idea. Yeah, you're going really well. Yeah, Jayesh Khanna or something. Who are your favorite Bollywood actors? I think we have respect for all of them. Uh because everyone is uh, hard worker, hard hard working people and very talented. So Vijay Sethupati. Yes, oh, he's amazing. Okay. Very talented. I guess it's been 12 to 13 years since you all have been together for now. So, uh, apart from dance steps, what is the cultural wise that you learn from each other on a day-to-day -day basis? So we we learn everything from how to behave. We learn about each other's religions, uh, backgrounds, cultures, and we what we use on uh, like daily basis. And uh, yeah, it's just uh, it's just that we just follow because some of us are uh, older than some, uh, someone else. So the younger people look up to the older ones in our crew, and we learn every day. Do you guys also fight, or uh, or do you have quarrels amongst yourselves while uh, preparing or choreographing a dance? So do you fight as to which step is gonna look the best, and then you start quarreling that no. Uh, maybe Bilal says that no, it's my step that is gonna look better, or maybe then someone else is. Yes, definitely. Like look at the scar. There's there's battle every day with. Oh it's go, it goes far. I'm, I'm, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. No, but of course uh, we disagree, and we agree a lot. So that's the best answer. We of course. But we always have in mind that we want the best product. in the end all of us so it doesn't matter if uh, you're in the front or or you made this move or whatever is the uh, what we created in the, in the end that's the most important for us have you guys ever witnessed a wedding procession a wedding procession yet. not yet in yeah. india not yet But not in india but we uh, we experienced one one in dubai oh in dubai did you witness a wedding procession as in a barat do you know the hindi term for is it uh, it is barat No, but not specific Indian yet. So soon. Have hopefully. you have you seen how people weirdly dance in a wedding procession? It's, It's amazing. amazing. That should be my question. Can you show me the weirdest? You haven't seen, so you should show us how. <laughs> oh my God, that was my question. You stole my. Did you steal my script or my question? Okay. So any any weird steps or cool steps that you ever found 
and then you inculcated uh, them in your choreography as well you know there is mostly like punjabi weddings yeah and most of the guys they can't dance pangra <laughs> yeah. so they're like it seems like they have epilepsy <laughs> while they're doing the pangra so it's like not attractive at all but it's funny the way they do it you know they can do like like whatever they do weird yeah, ways yeah show me some steps show me some not steps not us yeah. i'm talking about other yeah oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, but i don't know i feel like um, it's hard to dance uh, when you dance from your heart in a wedding that's when you look good so good so like I love truly said every style in wedding doesn't matter don't care okay so let me tell you guys since you are in here in india in india during the wedding processions there is a very famous dance step that everyone does okay that's called the nagin dance have you heard about it oh my god see guys it's world famous the nagin dance is oh my god everyone yeah amazing <laughs> Actually it's not amazing. It just looks stupid. But... <laughs> no, like whatever you guys are doing right now is just cool and amazing. Thank you. So, what about your food cravings? Like wherever you are going, like uh, do you like keep in uh, mind that whatever we are eating it has to be healthy because at the end it's going to affect your uh, physical health as well. So, do you keep in mind or you just go with whatever cravings you have? I was at school so I've been um, having very like discipline yeah. regime at school so i was just uh so i just uh so no so i just uh figured out that it was very important to figure out uh, but but later, this year we had like tour around 22 cities and it was not a healthy diet it was pizza after, after the shows yeah it was uh, it was not good but it's important but it's important to have acai bowls and have some eggs Avocado. Just, just be honest that you eat a lot of candies. Yes, the, the most discipline. The most candy. Yeah, you eat a lot of candies, bro. Okay. I guess yes, something to say. Uh, when we are together and, uh, and traveling, we all know that this and this are good, and this is maybe not so good. But we have to just make solutions sometimes. You know, we are in a hurry. We have places to go. and then we have to okay just this pizza pizza is fine and we love food we love all kinds of food but we all have uh, knowledge in the, how to take care of our body body anyway yeah and then great metabolism because after that you guys just managed to have such lean bodies after having pizzas every day right uh, yeah i got to say that also um, of course we always think about eating the healthiest like we can at least Uh, some of us um but actually when we're traveling a lot it's it's pretty hard sometimes to always eat healthy because sometimes you you don't manage to find the most healthiest food when you're around in between cities and like you just need some food on the road that's why we wake up 6 a.m. in the morning to do workout together every morning right oh, guys yeah is it true yeah. is it true i want to ask you is it true it's not true <laughs> i'm sorry busted but busted right there busted. but we have a lot of uh, training and uh, some of us exercise and but we we have are you saying to cover this up i try <laughs> i try but yesterday i was running he was running rafa was running dilan was just pretending and uh, the rest of the guys just chilling was doing temple run this is it in the bed face down school he was actually borrowing my villa was running as well 5 minutes Th- actually 10 minutes okay but the goal the goal is to be better oh my god yes of course right. definitely definitely <laughs> well said you know when you have sense you talk right so speaking of uh, bollywood again coming back to that uh, when you guys uh, you know just uh, choreograph uh, the entire sub so do you understand the meaning of the song or you just go by the beat the melody Melody. Usually the melody. melody. We don't understand the meaning, but we understand the feeling. The feeling. Okay. Usually the feeling. Of course, we understand the lyric, but the uh, I understand because I understand the language, but the guys don't understand. But they understand the feeling and the vibe of the song. Yeah, and also we explain. 
<laughs> no, you said it. That like they are, uh, they want to explain certain words, and they are very uh, good at explaining the intention of the song, the meaning. Yeah. But not all all the words, you okay, know. Okay. Okay. But you do understand the meaning of. Yes, them, that's important for us. Yes. Okay. So I heard that uh, you guys are really interested in uh, rapid fires. Yeah. So I have a quick rapid fire for you. Yes. Ready? Yes. Ready? Yes. Energy guys, are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Favorite Indian song? Oh, oh. Energy. 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 Okay. Oh my god, there are a lot of. Okay. Out of the entire group, who is the one who forgets the steps? Oh, Bilal. <laughs> Favorite Indian actor, but dance-wise, like who's who's your fan of the dance moves? Govinda. Govinda. Oh, one step, one Govinda step, one Govinda step. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Next. Uh, who is always late to practice? Oscar. Oh. <laughs> I guess the fingers are pointing somewhere else. Three hours later. Three hours? Yeah. Oh Sometimes my God. three days. And then favorite heroine in terms of dance? Uh, Ashwarya Rai. Ashwarya Rai. She was she very good dancer. Indian street food. What about? What about? Oh, what about? you you just told us because you what know about? this what about. Okay, any Indian slangs? Indian slangs. Are yaar. Are yaar. <laughs> And last one, Indian uh, movie dialogue. Favorite Indian movie dialogue? Rokhna hai, to talk no Yeah, that was quick side.